Hello. Hope everybody's having a good time. A good day so far, I mean. Um I have uh, I was initially gonna stream today. I didn't think I'd be home, but I got home and you know I decided, you know, let's play some games. So today's gonna be uh Breath of the Wild. Hey Final Ari, I'm okay. How about you, man? I still forgot to open chat. Damn it. How are you, newbie? I'm decent, bit sad, but can't complain. Want to talk about it all? Or, no, should I do normal mode or master mode? You go to game to get the one hit obliterator, it only deals one damage outside of the quest? Yeah, I know. I hit 1k deaths against Yaron. Oh, shit, dude. Yeah, Yaron is fucking hard. Sh guys, should I do normal mode or master mode? I'm gonna do. I'm, I do normal. Okay, okay. I guess it'd be good for like you using Breath of the Wild as a calm stream. Or the guns in this game. I mean, you could technically make guns, but that's whatever. How's that it going, Gumbo? Also playing Breath of the Wild at the moment. Okay. How can this game be American without guns? I don't know. Actually. Do I want to do master mode? Fuck, I don't know. Holy shit, this game is five years old. Damn. And hey, you know what, fuck it, I'll play in master mode. Alright, uh, new game. This game is older than newborns. Yeah. The, the kids when this this game came out are now in kindergarten. Um I am playing this game because I wanted to give open world a try again. I always liked open world games, but I know it's not for everybody. Like Is this game a tad quiet? Oh yeah, I turned it down because I was playing with others yesterday, so I'll turn it up a bit. Open your eyes. I need. I turned it up quite a bit. Let me know if you get later if it's if it's too loud for you guys. Wake up, Ta Link. Time is wild. There are twelve-year-olds out there. They just grew up. It's twenty. Just grew up. <laughs> it's, it's, yeah. My issue is open world that I often have too much freedom. I need a clear goal and mission so I don't get lost. Yeah, I think that's why I c that's like Breath of the Wild is good because you can either just go directly, and that's your open world, or you can visit the, all four of the the beasts and that's your open world. I think I get fucking my ass kicked. You cannot go anywhere in this game without hearing the damn piano music except Zora's Domain. No, you can hear different music in the desert too. And the drum beats in, uh, um, what's it called? Death Mountain. That is a Sheikah Slate. 
take it. It will help guide I you into your long slumber. Alright, hopefully I got them. I want it. What's what's the reason, newbie? Open world this entirely depends on how easy quests are to follow for me. Yeah. And that you're not going every single witch and wait for it. I'm a hardcore simp, a shrimp, that's the whole reason. Okay, okay. Hold the Sheikah slate up to the pedestal. Forgot I turned on big that balloons. Ha! Show you the way. Probably blinded. Must shine upon high rule once again. Now go. Hey Techno, how's it going? Now go. Nope. I wanna go back to bed. Okay, the c fucking controls are backwards. Okay, much better. Thank you for the hydrate, and thank you for the bus check. Contemplating making some popcorn, why not? Make some popcorn, slap some toppings. Unless you like playing popcorn, and it's good enough too. I forgot the bus check. Oh, sack of. Oh, ass. Ow. People, we can play games. It's just, for me, it's just the back and forth. Which was the jump button? Because I could make dinner instead. Come on, Techno, eat something real. Something real, something nutritious. Get some nutrition into that body. First thing I did when I opened this game for the first time was swap the buttons because it's, I will never use X to jump. Oh crap, on my controller that's gonna be hard. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so why is attack? I don't like that. I should really go back to this, it's been eons, but I miss it. I mean, I'd always say go for it. Huh. 
how do I... I gotta use the D-pad, okay. If you swap the button inputs of your controller for itself from the, from the settings, it could help you with optimizing controls. Of course, you have to change it back. Okay. This is going to be a long playthrough if I'm struggling here. But settings, I mean your switch itself settings? Yeah, I ain't fucking with that. Especially since I have multiple. Think. Head for the point marked on the map in your Sheikah slate. Yeah, I, I know, Rose. I'm just trying to get re, re get a hold of everything. Lizard. I should probably speak, but you can see me. I didn't know the kind your kind could see the children of the forest. Well, if you're not to ask you, please return this tome. Yeah, I'll make dinner and then I'll get do some editing while I vibe here. Be semi-productive gremlin. Okay, let's not get hasty with productivity. <laughs> Well, I guess I'm not getting that apple. Just a second. Oh, okay. Um, OMG's the boy log. Aska, how's it going? Zaldo. My apple. I beg your pardon. I do believe that is my baked apple. You can't just go about taking whatever you please. Yes, I can. Oh, ho, ho, forgive me. I cannot resist pulling your leg. Please help yourself. An, an apple and an open flame make for a succulent tree. It's a bit strange to see another soul in these parts. Who are you? Mm -hmm. Me? I'll spare you my life story. Just an old fool who has lived here alone for quite some time now. What brings a bright-eyed young man to a place like this? Who are we? Huh. Answer a question with a question. That is fair enough. Oh, was the breakfast thing? I feel good enough to... I didn't actually eat breakfast. I really, really wanted scrambled eggs and, like, breakfast sausage, but... <laughs> By the time we got there, they already finished. So we just moved on. Also, Ace Fix, how's it going? Finally, you're a guy who maxes stamina or hearts first. Neither, I balance it. 
As I cannot imagine our meeting to be a simple coincidence, I shall tell you. This is the Great Plateau. According to the legend, it's the birthplace of the entire kingdom of Hyrule. Life is pain as usual? Ah. Sorry, man. That temple there, long ago, it was the site of many sacred ceremonies. Ever since the decline of the kingdom a hundred years ago, it has sat abandoned in a state of decay. Yet another forgotten entity. A mere ghost of its former self. I'm going to take your torch. Huh? Well, then just help yourself with that torch there. And how, may I ask, are you planning to use it? <laughs> to set things on fire. That is rather unnerving. Please be cautious with that, with around any gra uh, dry grass that might, might catch fire. You know, there are plenty of monsters in this area. The torch will make a good weapon if need be. <laughs> oh, we're just not swinging around without purpose. You must face your opponents and with and lock your sights on them. Okay, so that's the lock on button. Our torch is trash. I am very smart. Aren't we all? You know what? I'm going to do stupid. Wait, I don't have a bow and arrow. It'd be suicide. Durability is not an issue when you exploit glitches to transfer durability. I'm not doing glitches. Well, there is only one glitch I will do, and that's because I don't have motion controls on this controller. What the fuck is... Oh, okay. Ow. Okay. Keep wanting to press L and R for the stupid. It, he's gonna do stupid? I thought he was already doing stupid. There he goes. So I'll find games until you hear that song, you know, that song, yeah. Yay, acorn. Ah, I had a scratch on my nose. I'm going to try to avoid fighting for the most part. Because I don't have any bow and arrows yet.
And I, for those wondering, I'm playing on master mode. Herb. Does this game have ominous chance of cult summoning evil monsters from other dimensions? Yeah, usually. Is Master Mode Palmer Death or is it just super hard? It is super hard. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, you know what? You know what? Oh, I thought it threw its fucking thing. Okay. It's not even holding its sword. Is there someone telling you to go and find out go see the silver gold Lionel? Oh, it's gold? It's gonna give me treasure? Damn it. Well, maybe I could fuck with these guys. Ow. Me. Wonder how lar uh, wonder how hard Link throws weapons to make them break instantly when thrown at an enemy. Oh dear. Fuck. Okay, so I really need bombs. Anyways, how is everyone doing today? I know I said it earlier, but there's more people here now. Okay then. Hey, Dazzled Salt, how's it going? Thank you for the monster check. 
Oh boy. I'm not here? Okay. So I only have a time that I died jumping off this tower trying to get down. A lot, I presume. Is that the Sheikah Tower from Smash Ultimate? Oh shit, there's a platform right there. Like a floating platform. Funny magic. <laughs> I've already died. Sleep for the past one hundred years. <laughs> the beast. When the beast regains its true power, this world will face its end. I always hated like those things that have like the giant jaws. Ugh. What did you just call me? I missed those 10 minutes playing, even though they were just my f first playthrough. I'm gonna get my second or third playthroughs. You think you learned the first time? Oh, I forgot to read again. It's almost as though a long dormant power has woken quite suddenly. If you do not mind me asking, did anything odd occur while you were atop that tower? Ooh. You now you conceal the truth from me. Truth be told, I saw the whole thing untold from unfold from afar. Although I could not hear anything, I did see reactors if you heard something coming from the direction of the castle. <laughs> Hit the nail on the head, did I? Did you happen to recognize this mysterious voice? Hmm. Seems I have to uh, work to work. So I have some work to do as far as earning your trust goes. I suppose that's understandable. I assume you caught sight of the tr uh, atrocity in trotting the castle. Hmm. That is Calamity Ganon. One hundred years ago, that vile entity brought ruin to the kingdom, or brought the kingdom of Hyrule to ruin. It appeared suddenly and destroyed everything in its path. So many innocent lives were lost in its wake. He called you a oh, weird, <laughs> yeah. The first century, the very symbol of our kingdom, Hyrule Castle, has managed to con has managed to contain that evil, but just barely. There it festers, building its strength for the moment it will unleash its blight upon the land once again. It would appear that the moment is fast approaching. Hmm. 
I must ask you, courageous one. Do you intend to make your way to the castle? <laughs> you need not say a word. Your eyes reveal the ter determination within. Determination? From popular hit game Undertale? Wow! Here on this isolated plateau, we are surrounded on all sides by steep cliffs, with no way down. If you're to try to jump off, well, no, no death could be more certain. Or more foolish. Ooh. Of course, if you had a paraglider like mine, that would be quite another story. Hand it over. <laughs> oh, certainly, why not? But there's no such thing as a free item in this world, you know? Hmm. Let's see now. I'm going to trade it for a bit of treasure that slumbers nearby. Calamity Ganon is by far the most disturbing thing in this game. At least he looks complete in Age of Calamity. I guess. I've never actually seen Age of Calamity. Hmm. Come, let me show you something. No. Oh, fuck. Right, there's floaters in this game. Oh. When you the trial of the sword, I broke a lot of my shields because the controller I used wouldn't let me parry. Yeah, I noticed a lot of problems. Had uh, A lot of new recently made switches at that time had, uh, Z I think it's ZL, but, or L? One of the buttons. Uh -huh. Fuck you. Oh boy. Yeah. No, the problem is it's because it's the the previous Z button from the from the GameCube era. Nintendo wanted to be original. You know how it is. The four shrines of the Great Plateau are only the people who work in the game. Uh, most of the shrines are. Ten don't fucking call and set all and set are yeah. Magnesis.
and making burgers? Hell yeah, what kind of burgers are you making? What kind of toppings? Fun other bullying buds, yeah. Put egg on burger, boom, breakfast, hell yeah. If you get it like a sunny side up egg with just a little bit of cookage on the yolk, oh, makes it so much better. Ooh, nice. Well, it must be break fast. I like speed. No, it bre it's breaking fast as in like, I guess, not eating. It's that kind of fasting. Pro tip. Yeah, I know that's, I know that rose. I can't eat eggs. Why can't you eat eggs? Put in bacon and aioli on them. Oh, my dude, you are speaking my language. Zoom <laughs> smash window run away fast, huh? Someone gets highly upset about eggs for some reason. Are you allergic? <laughs> I have won all of everything. One orb, one shrine, one poop, one uh, rupee. <laughs> Stop calling me that. Don't see me calling you old geezer. See, so you managed to get your hands on a spirit worm. Well done. Paragraph, please. <laughs> I encourage you to slow down for a moment, my courageous friend. First of those towers and awakening of the shrine. Hmm. It's all connected to that Sheikah slate you carry on your hip there. Paragraph, please. <laughs> I have yet to finish speaking. Long ago, the highly inhabited tribe known as the Sheikah inhabited... Or highly advanced tribe known as the Sheikah inhabited these lands. Their great power of their wisdom saved this kingdom time and time again. Well, their technology disappeared long ago, or so it said. It's interesting, however, to think that something like this, like that, survived all this time in a way in a shrine. Hmm. These shrines are tucked away in numerous places all across this land. On this plateau alone, I believe there are still three more. <laughs> Bring me the treasure from each of those shrines, and I'll give you my paraglider. So I need more now. I said treasure. I never said there would be only one treasure. Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, every every time uh, this guy comes gliding out of nowhere, I want everyone just to yell ho in chat. But this one treasure for what's the difference for a young go-getter like yourself? Since I'm feeling generous, I'll also teach you a trick for finding shrines. It's always best to survey the area by looking around from a high point. Let's see here. How about you made you wake to the top of the tower again? <laughs> Are you joking? Oh, oh ho. Afraid not, but do not worry. I have another little trick for you to show for your effort. Take a look at the map on your Sheikah Slate. Hmm. See those blue icons? Just recognize it came, came from where you woke, the shrine where you came from, and the tower. Remember making ca actual burgers and putting on bacon, salad, aioli, potato slices, and more bacon? Hell yeah. For me, it's lettuce, tomato slices, sauteed onions, and mushrooms. Uh, if I'm feeling up to it, a fried egg, and then I always top with a little bit of mayo and some Dijon mustard. Oh, oh, and a pickle. I gotta, gotta I gotta have the bread butter pickles. <laughs> give, give priceless relics, get dusty old glitter. Ugh. We travel instantly to any of those places with the Sheikah Slate. Hmm. Or so I heard quite some time ago. I do not know if it actually works as such. Okay, don't care. I'm good at this game. Man. 
nice. Oh, there's fish in here. I need fish. I also make buns out of rice often. Interesting. I want to do something. Alright, where's the tower? Right... There. First off, let's get rid of these. Actually, no, what? No. <laughs> this is gonna be funny. I'll be using fishing rug. Final. It's called Russian fishing. Yeah. If this works, you know I'm gonna fling myself. Oh, that's that's really disappointing. Actually, what if I moved it a little more this way? And now I place this on it. That's depressing. This is probably going to get me killed. <laughs> Alright, three, two, one. <laughs> okay, I didn't know what I expected there. Huh. 
Oh boy. How are you not dead? I'm not sure. Oh, there's a fish here. Hello, fish. My moblins. Yeah, I know. How many times have you played this game? Six, seven times? Eight, maybe? Including the, both DLCs twice. Yo, Final, did you know that the protagonist is called Zelda? No. What kind of abilities do you think Lunk will have with the sequel other than what's in the trailer? I don't think really he'll... I don't think he'll really have anything. I think they'll try to think of abilities, but then go with something completely different. I'm hoping they have like actual dungeons again. Alright, uh, my axe is kind of busted. Do I still want to go and fight it? Maybe later. Thank you. 
Toasty. Sorry, I'll do the Mortal Kombat. Toasty! I've returned. Welcome back, Techno. How's it going? I think I just had a stroke. I literally just said, he is our half our is the die. He does our half our the die. What? <laughs> Are you okay, newbie? Yeah, I am fighting that. I'm not okay, I'm newbie. Oh. Oh. Okay, you got me there. Let's run, buddy. I gotta remember it's X. Hey, look at that friendly guy. How am I going to visit him? Hey, Yuri, how's it going? Thank you for the hydrate. Did you have fun yesterday, my dude? Are you feeling good after yesterday? I woke up with a slight hangover. I hated walking downstairs. For the most part, I'm okay. Thanks for checking up on me, though. Are you doing alright? Maybe I've just outplayed the hell out of me. And now, also. Oh, fuck. I feel awful, but hey, I got some pizza. Hell yeah. So I'm just taking it easy today? Uh, as one does. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, I gotta restart my fucking tracker. Of course, Link dies of a fucking concussion. Did you have fun after yesterday, though, man? Like, I know, I know he was like a new group of friends, minus Donkachi. You've, you've been friends with him before. I wanted to make sure you didn't feel like. You've been with Joe yesterday? Shit, how do you know Joe? That was supposed to be Joe. Who's Joe? Joe, <laughs> mama. <laughs> Fucking got him. It was really fun. The uncle definitely helped me relax for a bit. Well, I'm glad you had fun, man. It was it was an awesome. It was a blast playing with you and everybody else. Next thing we're planning is next week is a uh, VR chat. You don't need VR, but you can.
You think you might join in on that VR chat, URI? It's it's that one's that one's instead of like an actiony packed one. It's more just like shoot this shit together. That was lucky. And uh, we can never get VR chat to work. All right, no worries, man. Hopefully, another thing at another time. No, like I know some VR, no VR chat is fun, but every time I try to set up something with VR chat, just never wants to work. And the UI just doesn't make sense for me to navigate. No, that's totally, to totally understandable, dude. No worries. I'm not trying to like pressure you to do something you don't want to do. Or, or I can't get to work. I mean. Amoga state? Maybe. Maybe one day. I don't know if I'll play that one again. I wasn't the biggest fan. Actually, if anything, I might get my friends to get, like, Traders in Asylum or something. Because at least both Avery and I have experience. And it's not too, too different from, like, Among Us. Every time I played in VR, I had a shit ton of motion sickness from just from sitting around. I mean, some, some people are more susceptible to it. I guess you just won't be playing uh, Skybreakers then. I, I'm thinking about releasing a PC, like, a, uh... Is there a shield around here? Why did I throw it that way? If you do TIS, let me know. I will. Yeah, just gotta remember, we gotta see how comfortable pe people are with certain groups. Oh fuck, that one's alive too? Was that noise? Gordless. By the way, how was uh, Chairs in Salem yesterday? Don't shoot me.
That was not brilliant by any means. Oh, fuck, okay. I just launched that fucker to orbit. Why am I stupid? Building for Diana, who apparently met her breaking point roughly halfway in. Her breaking point? And spawned a meme during the last game. So apparently no one's heard the phrase out of your cord before. Really? I use I've used it quite a bit. Diana Alt F Ford? Ah. Diana plays League. I I she's an okay person, but I feel like sometimes her rage is a little bit warranted with some of the games she plays. Oh, fuck. Is there gold or silver line all around here? Just normal. I think. Yeah, just gold. Yeah, just normal. I mean, I don't personally think Diana rages that badly. I think she's pretty calm compared to other people. Yeah. I guess. But, but like, it's, it's just the rage game she plays. Like League and shit. I can't believe that worked. I got the end of TIS, so I didn't see Diana molding, but I did see all the tech. Problem is, I don't know what to think. Uh, isn't there an option in here for... Oh yeah, I, I love this. Is there being the change you want to see in the world? Can't wait for someone to draw a techno version of the Megamind Faith with no chords. 
I mean, I could, but I don't think my drawing would do it justice. Time to draw Richard. Why are you drawing a tallywhacker? I was a little bit scared for a second. I did not know this was a thing. Final was your favorite video game feature ever. My favorite feature? Hmm. That's actually a really good question. I can't. Hmm. Hmm. Random feature. Hmm. Problem is that there's so many in different games. MGS in a box. I really like the MGS's hide in a box. And it just, for some reason, just randomly increase your thing. It can be your stealth in the, even in the middle of a forest. Um. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. My favorite is how 140 has zero menus. What's 140? <laughs> I think one thing, one feature that I actually like in video games is when your actions actually have consequences. Kill a character, that character is never there again. Fancy that, so we meet again. What are you doing? This tree make, might make for some good firewood. Hmm. However, getting a tree to fall exactly where you want it is quite an art. Just to turn your hips so that they face where you want the tree to land. Hmm. Just use an axe when felling tree. A sword works in a pinch, but you'll end up ruining the blade. 
Is there a sword or is there an axe around here? It's an indie rhythm game. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll look into that one. When will you learn that your actions have consequences? I should add that as a thing. I really gotta stop pulling that out. Why did that hurt me? No, you you only really need the first first line rose. <laughs> Preview reminds me of Geometry Dash, but like slower. It'd be good for for silly dumb people like me. There's nowhere where I wanted that to go. Good enough. Get up. Vanilla, have you ever played Pyre? Based on what you said, I think you might like it. I've heard... I've heard of it. I don't think I've seen gameplay of it. Fires are just bigger bonfires. Nope. Oh, and I looked at chat. So it's energetic yet melancholic electronic soundtrack. But the video on the Steam page seems to move more slowly than Geometry Dash. You know what's a good game that I really fucking love? Audio Surf. You should have cooked actual food. Ow. Come on, just go over the fucking edge. I got a free spear out of this. I'm so good at the game. If you haven't heard much about it, I'd highly recommend going in blind. I'm like, you can tell you the genre of the game. Can you link me the the, the Steam uh, thing on Discord? It's good. Okay. Oh, the video game Internet Explorer. Ha! Huh. Oh, you silly willy.
Your apples? Those funny purple mushrooms here. What other game? What other games is really good? Audio Surf, a game I haven't played but I've been recommended before is Fez. Although I don't know if I want to support the dev on that one. Only Yandere Sim. <laughs> yeah, I'll play it on stream where it's banned. Did someone tell me in all seriousness that Yandere Dev was someone BMG should model from? And I... Who said that? Oh, thanks for lurk, Rex. Some random, I want to say, pipe cord. I'm glad I didn't see that, because I would have fucking strangled somebody. I have zero fucking respect for Yandere Dev. I've seen people say they have trust issues because they they don't trust uh, indie devs because of what uh, Yandere Dev has done. Single most brain dead take I've heard, and it's probably leagues out of the average pipe core random. I wouldn't say that, no. I think. The problem is that. Like, I understand that a lot of. A lot of pipes, are like. The good fans are not like that. And I'm gonna stand up for the dude, because pipe, pipe deserves. Sometimes deserves having someone st uh, stick up for him. It fucking wouldn't let me stasis it. Oh, was that? Oh, I was. I didn't have enough time. You don't want to know, Rose. But, like, I, I understand that a lot of people comment to, to uh, Pipes Discord. Thinking there's some sort of big brain 
uh, person after uh, after uh, like playing Town of Salem. Like anybody who plays social deduction games thinks they're they're big brain. Are they actually? I have no idea. I wouldn't. Like everybody has stupid moments. It's mostly just hella skeezy business practices, but it, uh, it's not just business practices. It's it's him as as a personality as like. I just hit that poor gremlin. Whee! And people wonder why I still call myself a dumbass. I, I I call myself a dumbass too. There's no shame in acknowledging that you fuck up sometimes. What's the safest work thing I could actually say about him? Yeah, yeah. There's a reason I have consume as a meme on my channel. Gumbo, you wanna show that one off? Thanks, man. I just realized there's a cliff back here that I've never seen before. Look at really weird when I do because they point at my perceived to be high skill at TOS and argue that I'm not a dumbass. That's a thing. There's no modicum of uh like a, a respectable average for for social deduction games. People either think you're big brain because you know how to uh, trick people, or you just bullshit your way through things. Neither one of them is. How do I say it? Um, I w this is gonna sound terrible, and I mean no no harm, but it isn't entirely. Uh, it isn't entirely uh, skill based. Because people, as a whole, are random. <laughs> Wasn't this supposed to roll somewhere? Are you streaming? Is Mr. Perfect and amazing? It's smarter than Einstein. What else do you break my immersion? Ha! <laughs> Honestly, people should be allowed to fuck up. <laughs> That's awesome. I love, I love it when they run away and scream like that. See you, nerd.
Wang. Bro, the people who get on Pipes case for not playing a thousand percent perfect make me angry. Fucking me too. That's my... C I, I tried to encourage him once to, like, play other games. Like I suggested, why not Why not play Terraria with me? That way he gets this social deduction heat off of his ass every so often. And I, I talked to him once, and I don't know if he... Uh, I don't know if I should say spoilers or whatnot. T take what I say with a grain of salt. I think you planned on playing Celeste once. I don't remember... I think, no, it was a completely different game. I can't remember. But he wanted to play other games, and, like, isn't, he isn't keen on Terraria? I don't know about that one. I suggested he join in for chat Lamity once. Like, I would like to invite people to play, like, clat, like uh, Terraria games with me. Like, I'll just have, like, a little, a little world that they can come in, create something, fuck about, talk, talk, for a bit and then just leave. They don't. They don't have to come back. They can't come back. But but Chat got on his ass or something for 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 Celeste. <laughs> Dick Rock. I enjoy gazing out the world from here. Breathtaking view. It's maybe the best place to get a full view of the entire plateau. Did you know about the scope on your Sheikah slate? Look through it, you can pick a pin anywhere you'd like to mark excuse me, on your map. Ooh. Pins in your map serve as a reference point for your travels. Just take a pin anywhere you're interested. How do you know? <laughs> oh ho ho. A few tricks up in my I've picked up in my many, many years in the wild. You may take my advice or leave it. Go ahead and take a look if you feel inclined to do so. Hmm. You did make it this you did well to make it this far without the proper clothing. <laughs> Please take this warm double as a war reward for your tenacity. Hell yeah. Hmm. I assume you want to try it on right away, yes? I thought you might be eager to see how it looks. It's quite fetching. Well, I suppose it matters not. It's yours now. Do take care to put it on before you get too cold, though. Hell yeah. Cock a rock. I could have been beam wrestling, so like an entire salt shaker of salt on that one. No, I, I, I get it, I get it. I just feel bad for the dude. Like, I don't get how people can s stay playing one game for who knows how long. Like, with you and t uh, Town of Salem, Traders in Salem. Like, I understand the, co the coven is your thing, but... Like, eventually, if you get famous enough, people will be like, oh, Why aren't you playing this game? I subscribe for this. You're a bad person. Fuck, 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 fuck. Etc. Etc. I only do half and half intentionally. I knew that if I only did TOS, I'd go insane. Exactly why I did Chat Lamity and, like, other games. That's why I circulate my games. That's why I left Thursdays for collab streaming, because I wanted to add variety. How do I do this? Okay, I do this. I like sliding in this game. Nope, that's not it. This? Is it this? No. Jump the press A. Okay. Thank you. Oh, fuck. So 
For my variety day on Monday, I'm gonna do the thing I know him for on Thursday. Okay. Surprised Pippin still plays it regularly given how toxic the game players are, but maybe that's just my awful lobbies. I think it's a combination of like the the dude has a lot of tenacity. I I like more power to him and I'd like it's impressive how strong he is and resilient and that kind of thing. Like that he doesn't get toxic himself. Like he knows what the, he knows what the community is like. I bet you Nichols the Dimes, he knows what the community's like. He's not blind to it. And yet he still has like like the balls to keep on going and the, like the willpower to not be toxic himself. My feeling when Pipe pulls up with my molding ass. <laughs> <sighs> oh, sorry. Pitson is a wild person. I don't think I've ever seen him get mauled or genuinely toxic. But I don't watch watch very much of his content anymore. I I haven't been watching his YouTube videos as of late, mainly because it's mostly TOS based. And I appreciate the BMG devs for like for supporting, uh, like allowing me to play their game. I just don't know if like. The Salem community is like my community. I like being a part of it, mind you. Just. After I joined TOS, I quit for about a couple months because of someone being extremely transphobic towards me in particular. I know exactly who you're talking about. I think. Online games is chat boxes, unfortunately, yeah. And then you get the unmoderated chat boxes. <laughs> That's why I don't know if I'll ever make an, uh, like an online... Well, I'll make an online game with, like, VC only. There's one game I'd like to do after Skybreakers. That's like a, like a, a me medieval VR kind of... I want to say like an MMO, maybe, but we'll have to see. Oh, and Sky, thank you for dropping that Steam like I forgot to say. For game it was, but there was one where that would AI detect salt negativity in general and replace whatever person that said like, have a nice day, good game. Oh, I know which one you're talking about. Oh, fuck, which one was that? The, 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 oh, in, in Overwatch, if you say GG easy, uh, it, it replaces it with like, oh yeah, mom said it's, mom said it's my brother's turn to, f for the, for the game or something like it. It makes, it makes them say something insult, like, insulting themselves. Thank you, Buster, check and hydrate. With this, you have now acquired all of the spirit orbs from the shrines of this plateau. <laughs> oh, extraordinary. <laughs> that means it's finally time. Link, it's finally time for me to tell you everything, but first... Hmm. Imagine an X on your map with the four shrines being as the end points. Find the spot where those lines intersect. 
I shall wait for you there. Do you understand? Two lines uh, connect the shrines with cross. I will be there. Uh, there I will be waiting. Spooky. Post check results poor hydration levels before average. Yeah, I, I post check well. Open your family have a nice Christmas. <laughs> Fun fact: There's a flute trill in the at the nighttime of this, of this game. That actually is uh, like the same thing as a excuse me, a flute trill in the Earth Temple of Wind Waker. You know, oh fuck, I'm not. I was gonna start sliding down. <laughs> excuse me. Current ship status absolutely catastrophic. What are you talking about on that one? I just realized what? Oh, spl oh yeah, split gets fun. I haven't personally played it, but it looks it looks hella amazing. I oh my. There's a lot of games in which I wish they did like a. Uh, I was really weirded out by this weird stratospheric rays. There's a lot of games that I wish had, like, like, sequel counterparts. But, like, I understand that why they don't exist. Like, Portal 2. Can't exactly get any additional story out of Portal 2. Off of Portal 2, I mean. Context is a quote from this YouTube series by Marky e. Plyer. Okay. Apple. Oh, I do not have enough arrows. Plus, they went wild expanding on the premise, and honestly, I don't think they have anywhere to go after a banger like that. Yeah, exactly. I actually, no, they did make a technically a sequel, but it was a it was more of a uh, a spin-off game. I don't remember what it was called. Aperture job simulator? I think that's what I'm thinking of. You were at a desk and you just... Like... I think all you have to do is shoot things. Like, you actually had, like... Spoilers, but I don't think anybody's gonna be playing it. Because it's a VR game, I believe. You actually fought Cave Johnson. Desk job? That's the title, is it? I don't know if that sounds right.
some funny fucking toxic thing that I forgot instantly. Oh, well, whenever you're ready, just first off give warning and then say your your funny toxic thing. It's for Valve Deck. Oh, uh, oh, hold on. Uh, Big Floppa 2007. First off, appreciate the Floppa support. Uh, thanks for the follow. I appreciate that, man. How's it going? Why do I do this to myself? Good about you. I'm doing all right. What brings you to the channel, my dude? It's Big Flop of Friday. <laughs> I'm like 90% sure I'm half decent at this game. Maybe less. TIS has a new NPC. Nice. I actually don't have the game. Like, I never I never got a new key, and I don't know about my finances currently to be able to get a new game. Game is on Steam? No, I know that. Oh, that almost fucked me. Where are the most Pokemon? I can, I can answer that. Some of the po most Pokemon... Uh, Pokemon VGC. Uh, the J-Wits. Uh, Small Ants and Point Crow, maybe? They're more of a variety of Switch streamer. Wait, what, are you, what are you looking for specifically, Gumbo? I used to want to watch one of them on Twitch, and he ended stream several times at a pure mall. Doesn't sound like any I know. Sparkly. I used to think you play, used to play Rocket League on Twitch. I don't know then. That, I, I do not watch any Rocket League streamers besides Moist. Stop calling me that. The blessing of the goddess has made you that much more resilient, I see. Here I am. Get up here quickly.
Hell yeah. Fuck. Wait, Traveler's Bow is only do five. Sometimes I like the sound of the footsteps in this game, just pat, pat, pat. Time has come to show you who I truly am. I was King Rome Bosphoramus Hyrule. I fucking love the name Bosphoramus. I was the last leader of Hyrule. A kingdom which no longer exists. <laughs> the Great Calamity was merciless. It devastated everything in its path, Lo. It looks like he's just wearing underwear with how it's glowing. It was then that my life was taken away from me. And since that time, here I have remained in spirit form. I did not think it wise to overwhelm you while your memory was still fragile. So rather than that, I thought it best to assume a temporary form. Forgive me. I think you are now ready. Ready to hear what happened 100 years ago. To know Calamity Ganon's true form, one must know the story from an age long past. The Demon King was born into this kingdom, but his transformation into malice created the horror you see now. Stories of Ganon were passed from generation to generation in the form of legends and fairy tales. But there was also a prophecy. The signs of a resurrection of Calamity Ganon are clear, and the power to oppose it lies dormant. You know, I'd like to see it Zelda as a protagonist, but I'd also we like to see one day Ganon as a protagonist. And began excavating large areas of land. It wasn't long before we discovered several ancient relics made by the hands of our distant ancestors. These relics, the Divine Beasts, were giant machines piloted by warriors. We also found the Guardians, an army of mechanical soldiers who fought autonomously. This coincided with ancient legends oft repeated throughout our land. We also learned of a princess with a sacred power and her appointed knight chosen by the sword that seals the darkness. It was they who sealed Ganon away using the power of these ancient relics. One hundred years ago, there was a princess set to inherit a sacred power and a skilled knight at her side. It was clear that we must follow our ancestors' path. We selected four skilled individuals from across Hyrule and tasked them with the duty of piloting the Divine. <laughs> he said duty. With the princess as their commander, we dubbed these pilots champions, a name that would solidify their unique bond. The princess, her appointed knight, and the rest of the champions were on the brink of sealing away Ganon. But nay. Ganon was cunning Nay. and responded with a plan beyond our imagining. He appeared from 
from deep below Hyrule Castle. Seize control of the Guardians and the Divine Beasts. And turn them against us. The champions lost their lives. Those residing in the castle as well. The appointed knight bravely wounded and lapsed while defending the princess. And thus, the kingdom of Hyrule was devastated absolutely by Calamity Ganon. However, and the JTV, princess really? survived to face Ganon alone. Link, you are our final help. The fate of Hyrule rests with you. That princess was my own daughter, my dear Zelda. And the courageous knight who protected her right up to the very end. That knight was none other than you, Link. You fought valiantly when your fate took an unfortunate turn. <laughs> Link always has the face like he's like considering where to take a shit next. Here you now stand, revitalized 100 years later. The words of guidance you have been hearing since your awakening are from Princess Zelda herself. Even now, as she works to restrain Ganon from within Hyrule Castle, she calls out for your help. However, my daughter's power will soon be exhausted. Once that happens, Ganon will freely regenerate himself, and nothing will stop him from consuming our land. Considering that I could not save my own kingdom, I have no right to ask this of you, Link. <laughs> Where should I shit next? <laughs> I am powerless here. You must save her, my daughter, and do whatever it takes to annihilate Ganon. Somehow, Ganon has maintained control over all four divine beasts, as well as those guardians swarming around Hyrule Castle. I believe it would be quite reckless for you to head directly to the castle at this point. I suggest that you make your way east out to one of the villages in the wilderness. Follow the road out to Kakariko village. Kaka. There you will find the elder Impa. She will tell you more about the path that lies ahead. Consult the map on your Sheikah slate for the precise location of Kakariko village. Make your way past the twin summits of the dueling peaks. From there, follow the road as it proceeds north. Well, wow, the guy looks so chill in his videos and just mull the shit on the stream. I mean, some people have split personalities like that. Uh, on and off stream, I mean. Go on, here's a paraglider, just as I promised. With that, you should be able to safely fly off the cliffs surrounding this area. And I think that's it. I've told you everything I can. Link, you must save Hyrule. Alright, question for you guys. Do you think it would be interesting for Legend of Zelda to have uh, like a love story portion? Like for like Link or Zelda to f Link, and Link and Zelda to fall in love or something. Okay, let's let me let me rephrase it. Would you guys enjoy it if that was the case?
I'm not huge on love stories, but their stories basically have always been there. Or at least that's what it looks like. I don't think so. I think, in my opinion, from what I've seen from Le from Legend of Zelda stories, is that Link is more of a chivalrous go-getter kind of person, you know? Truly bound to each other. The only time I've ever seen a part of a love story is in Skyward Sword. Then again, I'm always kind of a romance nut. I can't believe I did that. Fucking do it too late. What do you guys think of like gender bents? Uh, like Legend of Zelda. Like they already have a Linkle from like one of the Hyrule Warriors games, but what about like a Prince Zelda and a Linkle? And like Prince Zelda gets gets fucking kidnapped. What would you guys think about that? It all depends on how well they do it. I okay. Imagine it's like the normal, the normal base game for. Uh... Okay, like think think Breath of the Wild, but uh, they they do it like they just it's all it's all the same gameplay concepts. It's all the same. All, all, all the same kind of gameplay concepts, the same, the, the prince gets kidnapped, etc.
I'm surprised there's no bird nest up here. I'm sure there is. Money. Oh boy. What do you guys think would be a cool concept for Legend of Zelda game? Fucking sci-fi? I think I think sci-fi would be really cool. I'm a big fan of Legend of Zelda, but I think it's like with the like technology of like the Sheikah and whatnot, I think it'd be very much doable. Tell me Zelda isn't already sci-fi. You know, that makes sense. Man, imagine a Skybreakers X Zelda game. That would be fucking hilarious.
There was once I saw a concept on... I don't remember where. But someone had done a concept for Legend of Zelda. But the instruments are like... Uh, like... Uh, electric instruments. Like an electric guitar and a... Like Link had an electric guitar and Zelda had a microphone or something like that. And I thought that was a really cool thought. The automaton of space. That I think would be actually hilarious. <laughs> if this thing rolls back on my head and kills me, I'm gonna scream. Oh, I won't actually scream. There's other people in this house. What do you think would make awesome instruments for a Legend of Zelda game? Because we have a baton, we have a pan flute, we have an ocarina, um, we have a harp, we have drums, uh, we have, I guess, something similar to a guitar. We need a banjo. You know, you say that, but then we'll get dueling banjos with Gan, and, and I'm probably fucking going to, like, crap my shorts or something like that. It would be hella rad, that's for sure. I'm just saying, we're gonna get a... A duel a dueling banjos with, uh... Who the fuck is attacking me? We'll, we'll get dueling banjos with Ganon. And <laughs> Ganon came down to Georgia. Ah, oh, you fucking asshole. Fuck you. I like the idea of Link having to... No, uh, Link and a keytar. Imagine Link with a keytar. I think it would be hilarious. It'd probably end up like a regular show. <laughs> I thought that with I thought my joke was just bad. <laughs> it really is what you were talking about. <laughs>
Oh, fuck, wait, this is, uh... You know, if if Nintendo ever wants to make like a like the like oh fuck, there's a oh, there's a dark one. That's not what I wanted. See nerds, I got what I wanted. I wanna play the f I wanna I wanna play Fortnite, but I don't wanna deal with May the Fourth bullshit. I I I. I not the biggest fan of Fortnite, but I mean, I understand the appeal to some people. May the sixth be with you. <laughs> doesn't the bit does the bit doesn't last multiple days? Why is the event still going? Because game companies need money. No, it's Revenge of the Fifth. Gumbo fake nerd. Was there an Aurora I just saw? Actually, Aurora Borealis in Canada can happen at any time of the year. It's just most predominant when it's in the winter time. Hell yeah. That's it over there. What's what is that? Because I think that's the plateau there. How do I use the? 
this? Yes, is that. Oh, that's uh, Satori Mountain. I know what it is now. Can Canadia weather be wild? You should come and visit sometime. Come and see what it's like. People say it's wild, but it's, if, if you're dressed appropriately for the weather, it's not too bad. Would you like that way more than like desert? You say that, but I'm also <laughs> I'm also one of like I enjoy the heat. I need to re-up my passport first since I accidentally let it lapse. I that that makes sense. Alright. Um Time for Mr. Fisty. Well, I mean, you're, of course, you're literally fire. <laughs> no, but I mean, like, seriously, in real life, I produce a lot of heat, like body heat, and I have, like, an, an intense, like, enjoyment for heat. I was born in, in the hottest province in Canada on the hottest day of the year. Oh fuck it, regen's health. Oh, wait, this is a luminic uh, talus. I don't want to do it. I think the talus music is probably one of the best in the game. I did not know the Talus has had a family. Uh, it's Tali. No, it's, it's.
Yeah, I ain't listening to that shit. Uh, why? Excuse my poor choice of language. I'm messing with you, turtle guy. Anyways, turtle, how's it going? Telunculuses. Going the right way. Should be a shrine up here. If I remember correctly. Not much just grinding the spirit tome wisps. Nice. I still have the... Oh, is there no more Xenoblade quest? <laughs> Talsticles. What is wrong with you guys? I thought there was... Oh, it was right underneath of me. Alright, uh, where's the things? Can someone remember this for me? Five, six. Wait, is that the right? Is that the right one? Yeah, I'm gonna presume so. Five, six. Twelve. Five, six, twelve. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Nineteen. In yeah, 19 and 22. Can someone write those down? I, I remember. Okay, thanks. Oh, maybe I maybe I got the quest now. Yeah, I did get it. Southern sky from the middle of the largest bridge. Eastern sky from the skull's left eye. And the southeastern sky from the peak of the tall, pierced, snowy mountain.
There's a shiny one. Oh shit, there was a lot of good stuff in here. We go get the ferret clothes. Oh, I I fucking remember what those are. Uh, how the hell do I get up? How the hell do I get up? That thing is still trying to grab my ass. Wear cat ears, not everything is a cat boy, Gumbo. Though I think it would be kind of funny too. Oh, I'm very fucked. I didn't even see the fucking ground. I got really lucky there. Birds. Food water, we do not need these, only cat boy. Cat boy's photosynthesize. Uh, so are they plants then? Do you grow cat boys? Plant boy. <laughs> Turnip boy. Yes, yeah, so we're growing seven cat boys right now. Gumbo literally playing Farmville. All right, Scam, I'm going to need your help. Five, one, two, four, two. From left to right of ball in each row. Okay. I need I need you to do me, do me another read. The 
there's there's one in the bottom right corner too. I don't know how I don't know how you write that one. The row on the top ball has column five. So that'll be five, one, two, four, two. Okay. And you got this one written down? Just help me out. Okay, I don't want to go back and forth and be like stupid. It should be two, two, four, one, three, five. I am honestly shocked I didn't die there. I should make food. Alright, so five, one, two, four, two. Five. One. Two, four, two. Awesome, thank you. How's anyone supposed to figure this out? The, so the, the sign near the entrance says that yeah, you have to know what the other one is. Wait, is there a secret chest? <laughs> I think I wish to know. Oh, yes, it did. Okay. You are banned from climbing. Okay. Also, hello, Solar, how's it going? Eightfold long blade. Ooh. Uh, doing good, just vibing and much now. Nice. How about you? I'm just enjoying this game. Oh, fuck, not again. Keep pressing the wrong fucking button. So what you munching on, dude? Also, uh, Techno, you never met, you never said what you were eating today. I want to know if I have to give you grief for not getting a properly nutritious meal. Oh, oh, that was climbing. Oh, I didn't fucking think about that. I'm sorry. A sandwich with orange slices, nice. Back to five minutes. All right. Yeah, I didn't fucking think about that. Okay, but climbing a staircase does not count because it's walking up a staircase. Is that fine? Can I walk up this? Okay, but if I grab if I grab onto a wall, can I just drop from it? Because I'm not I'm not I want to like walk up this, but I don't want to. There we go. This grabbing is allowed, just no climbing? Okay. Fuck. 
Fuck this game. <laughs> Doesn't climbing just mean go up? Even jumping is climbing? No. Not necessarily. Oh, I didn't write down the other one? Oh, fuck. Did anybody else? I'm gonna guess, because I know this one was three. Uh, this one may have been five. This one, this one was five. Five, three. I'm gonna guess and say this back one was four. <laughs> Problem is, I can't brute force it because there's 25. Three, one, four, two, five. Thank you. I feel like this one's wrong. Hmm. <laughs> Who is Ligma? Oh, fuck's sake. I'll just realize something too late when making something. Sometimes. Why would you forget this time? Oh, it can't be the same one. Goodness. Don't tell me I have to do this procedurally. Guess we're doing this procedurally. I completely fucked up the drawing of a comic page because of the inconsistencies. I Rose, I think uh I'm in I actually don't know which one I'm in. Uh she Vanath. I think you should just go back to the other one. Oh, I don't wanna do all that climbing again.
Want the answer? Yeah, probably that'd be a good idea. So did just look it up. Yeah, buddy, at least he asked before giving me answers, which I appreciate. Two four one three five. Two four one three five. So it wasn't even close. I you got the last two at least. Now I'm just fucking with you guys. <laughs> wow! Yeah, I... How many to total trends did you complete off the Great Plateau for? Oh, off of the Great Plateau? I've completed all of them. Thank you for the boss track. Have I done, like, enough of this that I can just climb up now? Oh, I got a pop in my back that I really can't get. Oh, crap, a doodle. Is the is timer up? You're good to climb? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, no. Before, before Sol gets to me again. <laughs> Did you remember to write down the initial one of this? No, I took a screenshot long ago. And then I deleted the screenshot. I just don't want you guys looking at the, like, a massive amount of pictures of Pyro's boobs I took. <laughs> I, I, I joke, I joke. And if I, should, if I remember correctly, there should be like one more right at, the, right at the bottom of this. Somewhere. <laughs> Is there one more? As your second train outside the plateau. Thank you for that, Jude. Oh, Sawyer, thank you so much for the gift sub. I appreciate that, man. Oh man, you gotta maintain that lead. You've gifted so, it's like it's stunning to me how many how many you've gifted. Like, I, it's I it's the fucking cat. Why? Asshole just comes out of nowhere and fucking tries to claw my arm. Yeah, I'm looking at you, asshole. <laughs> a little stinker, yeah. But I love them all the bits. I can't be mad at him when he looks at me with endearing eyes. Oh, 
Like, my mom, like, says she sees nothing but affection whenever my cat looks at me. Even when I chastise him. I am the overlord of shrimpage. <laughs> So I hear you're using the, one of my uh, arms and one of my cousins as, as a weapon. Yep. <laughs> Techno, do I have to re uh, rip your arm off and beat you with it? So fun games until you can't close your neck trying to play. The uh, you should really discipline your cat then. It's not a very nice kitty. I always think it's healthy to discipline your animals. Not like be an asshole about it, mind you, but... No, I can do that myself. Techno confirmed part lizard. Where's the chest? The chest is there. So I definitely fucked that up. Fuck. Fuck. My cat's turn a year old on Wednesday. Aw. Oh, cool. That's awesome. I got a hat. Nice. Oh, these are metal. Yoit. Yoit. I think... Oh, what day is it today? Today is uh next week on Sunday. Next week from Sunday. Uh it will be Elohim's second or third birthday, I think. It'll be a second. Does Elohim even know his own birthday? Yeah, I celebrate by giving him some wet food. He likes the wet food. Also, sometimes I lace it with catnip. Just uh, he he knows that wet wet food day is like a celebratory day. So like Christmas, uh, whenever he's been a really good boy as of late. I make sure to treat my cat well. Why the fuck did it get so dark? They're gonna watch shows and watch out more. Okie dokie, so thank you for the work, my dude. When my cat's tell it's my dog's the best, the other day, I absolutely insane dog. For the exact age of my cats, my mom says they were three months when we got them. 
I'm sure they were older. Nobody has 20 kittens grow that big in a month. You'd be surprised. Elohim, it's almost your birthday. Good boy. What? What? No, you can't go outside right now. Do you guys hear him meowing? Wait, I'm on the wrong fucking side. Damn it, I wanted to go the other way. Yeah, I'm not gonna fucking sacrifice another weapon for this. Elohim, stop it. No. It said stop it. You can be good boy, just not loud boy. I gotta trim him soon. He's very pointy boy. Thanks for Lurk Rose. Uh, are bees black with yellow stripes or yellow with black stripes? Yellow with black. Stop it! Stop meowing! You can meow other times, just not there. Damn, guess I keep an orange kitten. What are you gonna name it? Oh, there you go, asshole. There, you can have some snugs. You like snugs. No, he just don't 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 feel bad about it. He's he just gets uh, antsy, but he wants to go outside and look at the peoples. But there's no peoples is out right now, so Catch. Okie doke. I want to be in the timeline where I have all the money I can afford to take care of nine cats. Why don't you start like a cat sanctuary in the future then? Just, just study to be a veterinarian and then like take care of your cats. Nice. I got some off fucking opal. Oh, that was very close to just kicking my ass. I 
want to lay down and be swarmed by cats. I do too. But then again, I'm happy with just the one. I'd, I'd rather have one love me unconditionally than several who kind of eh. There are a few places in the world with a shit ton of cats and it's great. Yeah, I have like the cat island in Japan. Which apparently like all the cats are super friendly. You can just sit down, pet one, and like eight more will show up. This is like Turkey. Yeah, I, I love religions that like treat animals in high regard. Pretty sure they have a bunny version of Catch Island. Interesting. Don't tell Moist that. I mean, you can tell Moist that. You gotta figure out which one it's called, though. There's an island in Canada that's full of horses. Called, uh... Excuse me. Uh, Sable Island. Oh, fuck. Oh, is there a, there's, is there a fix in chat? What do we say to that? Fucking bang. Thanks, really hope you're on a virus BT dark. That's so sad. Hmm. Hell yeah, money. Hey, I don't believe I made your acquaintance. Name's Beetle, but you can call me. Actually, let's just stick with Beetle. And if you forget my face, you can remember me by my Beetle-shaped backpack. Wow. Despite these dangerous times, you'll find me traveling all over Hyrule to fulfill your shopping needs. I stock many travel uh, special bugs and must-have items for travelers. And I always charge a fair price, or my name's not Beetle. Let's buy all sorts of things. If you're, not, if you're in need of rupees, gemstones in particular, fetch a high price. Ah. Oh. Then as well, there's 12 viewers born in 2020, 2010. Fuck, I feel old. Wow! Yay! Yay! What have you got? <laughs> oh. Uh, how much is that? That is. 
120, that's fine. Wow. Actually, yeah, I'll take the... Can I? I guess not. You know cheese is made of the moon. Yes, I do. Oh. I couldn't care less about what you have to say, dude. They managed to like uh, locate the torch that seals the darkness. Yes. Hey. Hi. How far away am I from Kakariko? Not that far. You know, let's make it to Kakariko. Uh, pick up some armor, and we'll call it quits for the day. <laughs> oh, that was a mistake. to get me farther for now. get off of it. Okay, I'll just be. Oh, 
I need some herbs. Okay. Asshole. I never liked horses. Armorath. Like the streamer? Wow. Oh, this has to. Nice. Shaka, you you can see me? I can't see you. Shulko? Then how are you talking to me, silly boy? I'm not fucking singing. It's been a hundred years since anyone has been able to see me. I'm Hestu and I need your help. Those monsters over there stole my beloved maracas. I think they're on the other side of those rocks. Can't use my powers without them. So please, please get my maracas back from them. Give this man his maracas? No. Yep. Oh, they're all dark goblins. Sometimes you reckon you'll die doing the, the Fire 64 Trial of the Sword? I don't know. Thank you. 
Fuck me. Well, I managed to get one. Yeah, I just figured, you know what, I can do the stamina drain. There we go. Ass. As to his beloved maracas, he's been shaking them since he was two years old. Do you know you compare your own bomb explosions? I did not, but that's an interest. That seems kind of useless. Shalakala, those are those are my maracas. Please give them to me. Here you go. But wait, there's something wrong with my maracas. The Korok seeds and got are inside are gone. How am I supposed to dance now? If I just want Korok seed and I can sing, dance and use my powers to help you. See so you have the power of inventory expansion, so let me know if you find some Korok seeds. The therapist was describing his office. He was listing off a bunch of shit mentioned a fish tank. Once he had stopped, only my response was as a half mumbled, I don't like fish. Are you okay? Got to be back on the first account. How's my voice? How's it going, Uni? I'm doing alright. Rose, don't say what they did to them. We're probably just literally incapable of social interactions and hate leaving my house. That's that's totally fine. I I wish you luck, man, in, in your social interactions, and hopefully, hopefully with your fair a therapist, it, you'll uh. It'll work things out, you know?
gumbo f and like I said, gumbo for you, or I don't know if I've ever said. You're you're more than welcome to message me whatever, dude. I don't know if those just depression anxiety, but hey, my antidepressant stuff should get better. Hopefully so. My mentality of creation is that when you screw up, find a way to implement it to the final product. Uh, no. When you screw up, you should try to find like a way to improve it, and then if that doesn't work, then you implement it. Sunbug feature, Todd Howard. <laughs> Haka Rico Village. I'm sorry, but I've seemed to have twisted my ankle. Let's see here. Sorry to see me like that. Say, traveler. Where did you get that object hanging from your waist? Well, you see. Yes, I see. Sheikah Slate is a symbol. It means you're the hero of legend. Though there are a few new, if there are a few who know of such a legends anymore. Well, Sheikah, I've been waiting for you for a very long time. Pipecord having a normal one. Someone is trying to summon Pipton of his evil. So Eldritch being one we all know that's techno. Yeah. What are they trying to do? Spam him? A second. Finals the Eldritch being it doesn't need to be someone. I'm not Eldritch. Okay, we'll do. Ah. Okay, so it was a real honor to meet you. Ha, I suppose you've used to that. You've lived along as you have. Branch. Where is the shopping district?
Please give me armor. Oh, the armor's not here. Welcome to the Enchanted. Well, welcome to Enchanted, my high-end boutique. By the way, that stealth chest guard over there is highly recommended. While you wear it, your footsteps are nearly soundless, but it's perfect for hunting and stuff. Or it offers very little fence. Small price for the extra stealth. What armor were you looking for? The actual, like, metal armor. That sucks. All right. Give me some extra heart. Alright, we'll do this, Look, since we're not actually buying armor, we'll look at the hero path so far, and then uh, we'll raid somebody. Soldier's armor is Hateno. Maybe. Go and being peace to Hyrule. Alright, here's path mode. Uh, play. Man, I died a lot at the beginning there. I went for quite a while there without dying. Ah, yes, right, right, right. All right. Oh, let's figure out somebody to raid. First thing I did in my current playthrough is get Majora's Mask that makes the game easier in terms of story. Eh. I don't want easier, per se, just... Like, enjoyable. All right. Uh, Abyssa is playing right now. Let's play. Let's raid Abyssa. Excuse me. Um, as always, I hope everybody has a good time. Uh, good night. Uh, and uh, we drop some sauce here. Here's the Discord if you want to join the Discord. Uh, YouTube. I just did a load of vods today. And uh, thank you for the hydrate. Wait, message, old man. Okay, I had a great time. Good night, final. Thanks, Raxius. Uh, let's stick, stick, stick around for the the the, the, the uh, raid. And here's the oh fucking. Here's if you guys if you guys want to help me out with my game, feel free to do this. Click on this link, and it'll help me do with my research. Um, the raid message will be. This, this, this is the raid message. There's just one Skybreaker? Nah. 
Stick around for the Raid Shadow Legends. Ha. Is it brought to you by Killshare. Okay. Um, I've, I don't know. That's the best I've rate my streaking. Anyways, I hope everybody has a good night and uh, take care. <laughs>